Welcome back. You're watching On Art. It seems like the team at Mojarto.com is also in the festive mood. So oh, yeah. we've got Rachel Charles here to talk to us a little bit more about it. Well, Anu, why should Durga only be worshipped on the festive season, right? Why can't you have her around you all year round? You know, which is why at Mojato, we've dedicated an entire collection of artwork to her, where artists have depicted not just her, but her entire journey, the worshippers, and so much more. Should we have a look? Let's take a look. Every year, millions across the globe, and especially Bengalis, wait for this time of the year as the mother goddess Durga, embodying strength and kindness, returns from her marital home in Kailash to her paternal home on Earth. Tears run down our cheeks as we bid adieu after a 10-day celebration of her homecoming. Our hearts resonate in the chant that she would visit again. Well, this festive season allow Mojato to help you bring home Goddess Durga. It's a curation with the artists from across the country. They all are interpreting Durga in their own ways, their own mediums and styles. While all the artworks are interesting, the two that I particularly want to talk about are uh, one by Subhajit Datta. He's a photographer and his work titled Kumar Tuli is actually a capture of the idol in the making. And the title Kumar Tuli itself is referencing the village where the idols are made right outside Calcutta. The other artist is Tapan Chattopadhyay. His works are uh, very bold, very aggressive strokes, but uh, in particular, he's juxtaposing the animal, the imagery of the bull, which in fact is the vahan, the ride of Mahishasur. So as you can see, it's a wide variety of interpretation, but all centered and focused at the core around Durga. Art that will keep the goddess close to you each day. Now at Mojato, we also partner with leading galleries from all across the country to bridge the gap between the physical space and the online space. Because sometimes galleries have amazing shows, but they all have a starting date and an ending date, right? So at Mojato, we make sure the show goes on by bringing the work to you online and you can view it at peace in your own time. This time, we have the Artoholics Gallery from Delhi on board with an amazing collection of FN Souza's works. It could be the variety of styles he brought to the canvas, or his rebellious streak that made him one of the founders of the Progressive Arts Group, or the single painting titled Birth that sold at $4 million. Francis Newton Souza, a Goa-born Indian artist, had all these reasons and many more to make him one of the leading Indian artists of his time between 1924 and 2002. Having even a sketch of his today as part of your space means completing it with legendary presence. The Artoholics Gallery in Delhi has acquired a series of his works that are up on Mojato as well. In this collection that we are showing, works are ranging from 1940s to 1990s. So it's a collection of whole period of Sousa, 50 years of Sousa. 1940s when he started as a student. 50s and 60s, which is, was the best and the peak of Sousa's works, then going down to 70s, 80s, 90s. So we've tried to put every aspect of Sousa's work in these sketches. So if one wants to create a collection, he has all the five decades of his work. And you can see the work changing over the period. As he progresses from 40s into 50s, then 60s, how the work has progressed. His works are most often focused on figures, his self-portraits, and the drawings that he did are classical distortion of the human figure and the human face itself. And that brings a very strong story and expression that Souza chose to say with his work. These are also works that have a clear record of ownership, authenticity, in other words, come with provenance. Every work we are displaying is published. It has been published by a very well-recognized gallery who have worked with Souza first time or it has been acquired from an auction. That is a renowned international auction, either Christie's, Sotheby's, from New York or in London. So you can trace these works, they're all online and they're in catalogues in the past. 
Well, that's all we have for this week. But remember, Mojato.com is your one stop for everything art. And that also means collectibles and jewelry. And of course, stories where we get into creator studios to understand why they create what they create. Keep watching us week after week and you'll understand why two lines of blue crossed with the red can also be called art.